first two years play at UConn, I'm not going to lie, I was scared out of my mind. So scared. I was just like, I don't even know how you play a number one team in the country. How? Like, I don't know. I think that there's a lot of work that we have to put in because changing the culture right now, it's going to be hard to change any culture. But if we just put the work in and just keep working and fighting every day, It'll come. I'm really excited. Like I have confidence in my teammates. Like we've been working since the summer. Um, and we've we've had close games with big teams. So it's like it's all about that 40 minutes. I want all of our players to know once once we st come into the gym and step in between the lines, everything we do is to make our program better. Our basketball team. Um, and SMU women's basketball program better. I don't want you to check the box just to do the damn drill. We're not checking the box today. I definitely feel like we're still in a process of trying to change the culture um, of this program. So it's just, we're still in a process. We're a young team and it's gonna take some time. We've been maxing out day one on the culture. And you never know when it actually changes. Um, it, you can say the culture changes when you're getting talent. You can say the culture changes when you get wins. You can say the culture changes when you recruit a certain leader in your locker room. But I think it starts when the players start to consistently speak your language. They start to um, develop a consistency of trusting your details or your vision. Uh, and I say right now, we may be just opening that door. All right, one, two, three. Compete. Compete.